Hello, people. <laughs> God, it's kind of hard for me to put this. I don't know how to put it. It popped up in my head earlier, and I'd walk away from the computer, and I'd come back, and I was watching this video, and um, it popped back in my head. I'm looking down because I'm looking at the picture of me right here. The camera's up high, so my eyes go down and look at myself. People do that. So people think I'm reading the script, which is not this piece of paper, which is actually a calendar. So, not a script. I don't do scripts. People call me a fake, but that's one thing I am not. It's fake. I'm tired of motherfuckers bashing Obama. Obama's gonna ruin our country. He's gonna do this. You woodwork ass motherfucking people. You're pitiful. You bitched and complained about George Bush. Oh, George fucking it up. And now Obama's just gonna ruin the world. Um, this video is not for certain group of people. This video is specifically for one group of people who I always constantly see bashing Obama. I'm not gonna say any races, any flavors. I'm just tired of this shit. You don't want everybody to have universal health care, so you scream and bitch that, oh, it's gonna hurt our health care. See, people are scared to death of healthy poor people. A healthy poor person might actually change their life around and do something better for himself and the people around him. You got good teeth, you can eat, you can be healthy. It doesn't work. It doesn't, doesn't, doesn't matter. People, people don't want to see equality. If everybody go to the doctor, fuck. Oh, God. I do think that his health care plan sucks. But that's just me. Anything is better than nothing I got. And what you have. Oh, I don't run. Oh, my kids will die because of this. Your kids are going to die because of what? Bush. What? Carter, what Clinton, what Reagan did. They ain't gonna die because of what Obama's doing. He may be the Grim Reaper, but he's not the one who called the Reaper in to play. I'm just tired of it. Obama's the worst president we've ever had. He's been a president how long? He's been ruining the country. How long has this man been the president? I don't care that he's black. Or half black. Or mulatto. Or whatever they call it. Creole or whatever. I don't care. But I know this. I'm tired of seeing videos about how Obama single-handedly thinks he's God. How Obama, when you watch all these uh, Glenn Beck and all these people like that. Rush Limbaugh's and shit. Limburger, whatever the fuck that motherfucking... Schweitzer, whatever the fuck his name is. Rush Heilzer, or whatever the fuck you call him. I'm tired of him too. We have one country, one political party, two sides. And the people fucking sit and suffer. And when one person said, let's do something for everybody, regardless of what he looked like. Oh, it's gonna ruin it for me. Fuck you. Fuck the motherfucker standing next to you. Fuck the motherfucker standing behind you. Your mama, your grandmama, your babies, your grandbaby. Fuck them all. If they can't be equal to my son or my neighbor's kids, fuck them. If you think you're the greatest shit on the planet Earth, you're supposed to. But forsaking other people, fuck you. Let the man fail before you destroy him. Let him fuck up before you're saying he's ruining it all for everybody. Don't speak for me. Speak for yourself. So as far as I'm concerned, when it comes to health care, we can all have universal health care, period. State of California, Medi-Cal stopped paying for people to get their teeth fixed. How can we have universal health care, period? 
certain things, you know, aren't like, you know, life or death. So universal health care, if you're not going to die, it's probably not going to happen. You got AIDS medicines and shit, you probably won't get them on universal health care. You have a stroke, need some special heart medicine, probably not on universal health care. But I did have a plan to provide every American with health care. I did have a plan. So every single child would get that pediatric care they need. I did have a plan to save the world. But who's going to listen to me? Is it because my color? It doesn't matter anymore. My size? No. My hairdo? Teeth? Ears? No. People don't want to listen to somebody telling the truth because they might have to pay for it. I had a plan. This is what it was. We have an army that fights wars. We have Marines back the army up because they might not be able to handle it. That's our Republican Guard. Shouldn't we only have one army? No, we got the Air Force too. And the Army's got their own Air Force too, right? I don't know. Got a what else we got? Uh, Coast Guard. We got, like I said, Army, Navy, Air Force, Marines, Coast Guard. All those are mechanisms of war. Mechanisms for battle. Defiance. Not an option. Those groups that I mentioned are all government groups. How come we don't have a medical corps? Just doctors for Americans. Doctors, just an army of doctors just so we can have medical. Here's the kicker. When you graduate from high school, you can go directly into the Marines, the Air Force, Navy, Coast Guard. How come they don't have a medical corps? graduate high school, you become a doctor. One of these doctors that walk around in our neighborhoods. One of these doctors we don't have to go pay for. Not a clinic with second-rate health care, old medicine, new tags. Not a clinic where you can, government can feed you some shit that you don't need. Not a clinic. We have hospitals closing in, all over the country. We need a medical corps. We got the Army Corps of Engineers to go fix other people's bridges, and blow up levees, but we don't have a medical corps. Kids, you get out of school, you can go die for the country, but you can't heal your own people. My plan for universal health care starts at home. My son gets out of school, he can go right into the medical field. And how many years you got to be in the Army before you get that GI Bill? How, how long you got to be in the Army? And when you get out, what are you? You're a soldier without a war. Medical Corps, on the other hand, once you're done serving your eight years for your country in the Medical Corps, you can go teach. You can go be a private doctor in one of these expensive ass places where people can't afford the health care. Or you can just die and wish you had health care to start with. I'm just so tired of people saying Obama's going to do this and Obama's going to do that. Obama can only do what Obama's told to do. Until we find a new banker, we have to go with the old bank. Until we find a new corporation, we have to go with the one we got. We cannot fire the people that control our country. But if we knew who we were, who they were, we would fire them. And they know this. So you can't blame Obama for listening to his bosses. Even though we hired him for the job that they gave him to do. You've been tubed. Say something, Dougie. Say something. Say something.